touch anybody that has an alarm so we can clear the alarm. But where's the alarm? You can't go back and forth. I'll just call your alarm. I know, but that's what's asking you. I'll just call your alarm. What is, what is the alarm? I just sold it to you on the street. I know, but if it's the zipper. I sold it to you on the street. But if it's the zipper. I sold it to you on the street. How many times do you want to tell you? But what if the screen is wrong? Well? I didn't have this problem leaving the app. Well, you have a problem now. So I'll call you here. Alright, you're all good. Is that clear? You can't touch anything. Let me put all this back in there for you. You took it out, right? I did. Okay. Would you like me to? You're welcome. I'll do it just for you. I just called it what it is. Yeah. yeah. Like give me a hard time? Yeah. Well, I'm giving you a hard time. I'm trying to clear you so you can get on your flight. But you're not allowing me to do that. Alright, that's good. We'll have the come now. Here's your bag, you. sir. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. You are welcome. It's a beautiful day, sir. This is what was lit up here. Yep. It's, it's part zipper. of your pants. Yeah, it's part well, of my pants. We're going to cut out the zipper? Yeah. That wasn't the only girl. Back of my head, folks. And then right here was. 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 And then right here
hand on your arm. So there was other areas, right? It wasn't just your zipper. Are wedding our rings allowed? To, that's our job to clear it to make sure you don't have nothing. But we have to touch you. We can't just take the words. So you have to physically with your hands touch it. Yes. Yep. That's a violation of my privacy. Okay. I'm just saying. I mean, why can't well, you? Don't have, I mean, you don't have to fly. Fly is a no, choice. I'm just asking. Fly like, is a choice. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just asking why I have to be touched. Why can't I be wanted? Well, I explained it to you. How many times do you want me to explain it to you? Why can't I be wanted? We don't do wanted. Why didn't I have a problem in the office? I wasn't in the office. So I can't answer that. But you don't know why. I wasn't in the office. Yeah, it is. I just need to. The only time we use the hand wand is if you have uh, an area that does not go through the walking mode or something. So, like a big hat on or something like that. Or the hand wand. You can back down and test your hands. And that's our job to figure that out. Do you investigate Not why yet. this is going off? Or do you just assume that people are having a furious or you can just come off? So we trust our equipment. Okay. Our equipment's been tested. We trust our equipment. When our equipment says we check it out. So if your equipment picks up my zipper pants, what is that? Would you check your equipment so it doesn't pick up zipper pants? No, I would check you for that area to make sure that area is clear. Okay, so so I'm the one in I'm the one wrong, and your equipment is always right. Correct? We trust our equipment, and what our equipment says is an anomaly or is an alarm, we clear that area. So you don't trust me? I trust my equipment, and I don't take individuals' you. words. That you, you, can tell all, you can tell us all day that you're clear. I can't I take you. Yeah. But you trust your equipment for picking up a zip, right? Why are we, why are we stuck on a zip? And there was other that's, alarms. But that's the area. That but there was other alarms, right? You, you admitted to that. Yeah, my bad. Mm -hmm. And your arms, right? And around this area? And then what if nothing's there? But is there zippers here? Nope. Okay, so why are we stuck on the zipper? Well, I'm just saying that that's an area that it picked up. There's and, other areas. Though. And then it picked up here. There's other areas. Okay, and then what if you don't find anything and there's nothing here? Then you're clear. But then you don't check your equipment. No, because we trust our equipment. That's my point. It's obviously giving off false readings. Yeah, so it's giving off a false We, we trust our equipment. That's all I'm saying. I'm, and all I'm saying is it's giving off. He's going to talk to him, okay? Oh, okay. Thank you very much. Is it? Cool. Public gathering place. Right on. This is fun. I thought so too. How you doing? Good. Should we do a selfie together? Do to you, man. Uh, <laughs> I got all day. So you're saying the selfie for advertisement, so this is planned? Just, no, not at all. This is just, 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 just a test or something? Cross my mind, man. Okay. Yeah. I can tell by the movie. Make sure you go to that website. Yeah, check it out. No, thanks. You're going to post it on social media, maybe your friends will. You know, if everybody actually had a problem with this, this wouldn't be out. Uh, so obviously everybody does have a problem. I know, because they conform. Everybody conforms? Yeah. So you'd rather just, there just be no security for it? For what? To keep the airline, to keep the airline safe, the traveling public safe, to keep the aircraft safe? From you just what? want everybody just to go on the aircraft? Yeah, it works Distrust, well. distrust the whole world. It worked pretty well in the 80s. Yeah, the 80s. Okay. You're, how old are you? Uh, it's not your business. <laughs> Things worked out pretty well back then. So, so you never heard of 9 11? What was never that? Heard, uh, what happened in 9 11? You tell me. Have you heard of it? No. Never heard of it. Go no. we'll look it up. Okay. Google. Okay. And if I do that, then you've got to look this up. No, I'm not looking up it. Okay, then I can't look up what you guys need. That's fine. That's your problem. But you don't know what happened in 9 11? You can't tell me? Teach me? Google it. You can't educate me? Google it. You refuse to educate me? Google what happened it. That's not my job to educate you. Well, I'm security. It's not my job to I'm not a teacher. You're yeah. not? No, not at all. You don't have kids and teach them? That's not your business. Well, what if I'm a child and I need to be taught about what 9 11 well, You should have parents, right? Uh, if you're a child and need to be taught. Maybe you're. Or, or a teacher? Uh, maybe you're in college? Well, I can't tell you that. Okay.
you believe what happened on 9-11? That's not your business. Well, you, you're asking me, you brought up 9-11 as if to yeah. say something happened on 9-11 where all this is necessary. Did I say that? You implied that. Okay. You brought up 9-11. So obviously you know what 9-11 is. Implied 9 /11. So you know what 9-11 is, right? Yeah. I, you said, I do I believe in 9-11? Yeah. So if you didn't know what 9-11 was, you wouldn't would ask a question. Because I don't believe it. Oh, so you know what it is then? All right. I don't believe it. But you know what it is? I don't believe it. Okay, you just admit it. I don't believe it. So you know what it is? Well, you didn't admit about this. So a zipper? About, zipper 9-11? About how your, your equipment could be faulty in getting on false readings. All right. We're on, two different, we're, on, we're on two different subjects. But you keep reverting back to the zipper. It's, it's part of this, right? <clears throat> I, wasn't there. I wasn't there on that one, so I don't know what happened. I wasn't there either. Right. But you believe what happened? Yes, of course I do. I wouldn't be working there. here if I didn't believe it. Even though you weren't there? It doesn't matter. Do so you trust second and third party information? We can go back and forth. Okay. Exactly obviously, this is, your, this is your plan. This, one. this wasn't my plan You just want to go man. back and forth. No, man, I mean, you don't want to catch your flight. You just want to say, don't touch me. And, no, I mean, I didn't and, have a problem advertise your website. I didn't have flat, a problem. Flat Earth, right? I didn't have a problem in Minneapolis, man. I wasn't there. 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 I just think, is there any consistency with the airlines at all? Consistency with the airlines? Yeah. Yeah, with Well, with there's airlines the... and there's TSA. So which one are you? So, okay, TSA, is there consistency with TSA? <laughs> yes, there should be. Okay. But I'm not everywhere. Because we didn't have this issue. There's only one of me and I'm in Denver, so I can't, I can't speak for other airlines. Okay, but you can speak for what happened at 9-11. Uh, yeah, from what I've been educated. Yeah. Okay. I sure can. Who educated you? Uh, the, the media okay. that educates everybody. Okay, and the media is always right? Did you know that the media can legally propagate lies to the American public? Really? Like saying that Earth is round or flat kind of thing? You're not familiar with that? No. Okay. Well, I, I would encourage you to check it out. Obama actually repealed that law and said that the news media can propagate false information to the, uh, the public. What happened in Pennsylvania when that airplane crashed into the ground? You tell me. I'm just saying, I mean... You brought it up, so you tell me. What happened? I, I want to ask you a question. You brought it up. What happened? You tell me. Well, the airplane disintegrated. Okay. So it's the first time an airplane ever disintegrated. You know that? Awesome. So there's no plane wreckage. You know, the first reporter that showed up at the Pentagon said on live TV that there is no evidence of airplane wreckage here. And then later, two days later, he recanted just, his Just statement. talk to your camera, because that's just, this is for your footage, so talk, take care of yourself. No, I'm talking to you. No, just talk to your camera. So, you know, that was on media. Ooh, talk to your camera. So the media guy said that he didn't see any evidence of a plane into the Pentagon. You don't awesome. believe that? Talk to your camera. Kind of hit a nerve. You definitely know how they uh, build buildings? Construction. Correct. How do they level 
The floors and the walls. I'm not a, I'm not a, I'm not a construction stuff. You've never built anything? I haven't built a building. So have you ever prayed, have you ever put a picture on a wall? Have you? Have you ever put a picture on a wall? Have you? Yeah, I have. Been. Okay, what did you do? I used a water level to level out the frame so that it's level. Did you know that water is level? No, I didn't know that. Oh, you didn't know that. Okay, so Nice. So water curves? Uh-huh. It does. How does water curve? You tell me. And then? You tell me. No, I'm asking you. You believe it. You tell me. I didn't say I believe it. I well, said you, you said that me. water curves. You tell me. And then? You tell me. Did you know that we can see over 1,800, 60 miles over Lake Michigan? Cool. There should be 1,800 feet of earth curvature over that body of water. Awesome. So, from one point to another, there should be a bend in the water to create a sphere. Because with a sphere... So this relates to the earth being flat? I'm just speaking freely, sir. Okay. Yeah, and you, just yeah, right. be, you just happen to be listening. Yeah, right. So we can see too far on Earth. You know that? The idea that ships going over the horizon, disappearing mast, uh, bottom first, it's just a myth. You can actually zoom objects back into focus. You know the pictures from outer space are like paintings? Admitted to be paintings? Photoshops? You know what realistic painters do? They paint realistic paintings, right? It's, it's very hard to decipher between what is a real picture and what's a painting. Mm. And NASA admits that Earth pictures from space are Photoshop. Mm. So there's no genuine pictures of Earth from space. If you Google image satellites in space, you get artist renderings of satellites in space. You don't get that. Picasso? Yeah. Picasso, did he paint? Did he paint the Earth? Uh, he may or may not have, I don't know. Rembrandt? Uh, maybe. Yeah. She looks into it. Um. <coughs> I change, I'm going to change your life. Yeah. You good? You just like doing this? Mm -hmm. Paying the yeah. yeah. American. Fighting for the country? Oh, yeah. You know when you pay your taxes, you're paying for uh, drones to drop bombs on countries you've never been? You got proof? Uh, yeah, Obama kind of missed it. Uh, oh, Obama missed it. So, because he said it. Well, it, it is from news media, right? Okay. So, I'm you just, believe the news media too? Then. I'm just using your form of news media to say that just, this is what Obama said. You just said you, you believe the news media too. That's pretty much what you just No, I'm using Because unless he told you himself right? that you saw yep. proof. Yep. So, I figured believe. that if I use news media as a means to show, to tell you facts, you would believe it. I don't believe it. Okay. So you would have to read the article yourself? Yep. Okay. Well, type it in. Obama drops bombs, oh, drones. Oh, you want to, you want to deny reality? <laughs> that has nothing to do with me, so why, why am I going to read it? Yeah, I'll because, I'll, I'll because you live in America here. and they're dropping bombs on countries you've never been before. So why well, I've never been? Yeah. You ever been to the Middle East? What do you think? I don't know. I don't know You know, NASA gets $52 billion a day to fake space. Yes. Fake space. Your space is fake? That's what you're saying? It is, yeah. yeah. Nobody's ever been to the moon. Well, I mean, you know, when you get pictures, right? And you, you, they're alleged pictures and they're photoshops. How can, how can a cartoon be real? Do you believe cartoons are real? Yeah. Okay. So how can you believe Earth pictures from space? Oh, you tell me. I, I don't know. I don't, I, don't, I don't know your experiences. You guys are too Yeah, you know. You know the North Pole, uh, the North Pole? Pole, Polaris. Is that fake too? Polaris, right? North Pole is fake? You know the North Pole and yeah. Polaris, right? It's fake. Did you know that there's no star parallax? 
So as if the Earth and the Sun and the solar system are traveling through space, like on Star Trek, you know, when they go into warp drive, there's star parallax. But there's no star parallax. It's, not clear. it's always in the center. I think your equipment's fault. Yeah, well, I think that's true. Kind of, what if I know your equipment's fault? Oh, uh, how do you know that? That it's getting off false readings. Uh, you know, you know how it reads. You know how it operates. Uh, how do I have it? Why, if you know it's faulty, you have to know how it operates. Right? What is it trying to read? You, you know how it operates. No, you know how it operates. You just said that. I didn't say that. You said you think it's faulty, so you have to know how something operates, right? To know it's faulty. So how's it operate? Because I don't have any. What, what do I have on me? What do I have on me that how do you, cause it to go off? How do you how do you say something's faulty? You don't know how it operates. That's my question. How do you know that space is real if you've never? Oh, so we're going back and forth. It's interesting circuit and logic that we can play, right? third-party information that's true and you think that your equipment isn't faulty. What are the trust? What about trust issue now? This is going. I don't have trust issues. I trust my organization. And it's important. And it's important. You trust your government? Everything that they say is true? I trust my government. Is there any government of the world that you don't trust? Why are you asking that? I don't know. Yeah. You trust the American government. Yeah. Really I live in America. I don't live in the world. So America will never lie? I live in America. Do you know what Agent Orange is? Yeah, do you? Yeah, I do. Yes. What is it? What is it? Well, I, I ask you, do you know what it is? You say yes. You tell me. But then you ask me what it is. You tell me. And you tell me. You tell me. You can go back to the That's for real. You can't give me answers? <laughs> I know why you can't Can you give, give me answers? answers. I know why you can't give any answers because every one of your peers here, if you give an answer, will have to question your uh, so patriotism. My, so nobody here has nothing to do with Agent Orange. <laughs> no, none of these people are able to speak freely and give their opinion. None of these people have nothing to do with Agent Orange. Is that where we still no, 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 are? No, we no, on another subject? Because I asked you what Agent Orange was, and okay. you know what it is. And you do too. I do, but you can't give me your opinion because it's on camera and everybody. You can give me yours though. I could. Sure. Would mean, you agree? You're live right now. Would you? No, we're not. You're live. Would you? You're agree? gonna be live. Would you agree? You're live though, so talk to the camera. Would you agree with my explanation of what Agent Orange is? Well, what is it? Uh, it's a chemical that was dropped in Vietnam on forest, and people currently in our military are still dying from Agent Orange. That's correct. Yeah. I agree. Did you know that the United States government did that? I wasn't there. I agree with Agent Orange. Yes. Okay. That's correct. So I just. That's declassified information that they dropped. From the 60s, right? 1960s? Late 60s, early 70s, yeah. So they killed a bunch of Vietnamese people. Okay. And the forest. That was unfortunate. Soldiers. That was unfortunate. Yeah. But you still trust your American government? Well, I wasn't alive in the 60s. Okay, so it doesn't matter? No, it, it does matter. That was an unfortunate situation. Okay. So anything you I trust? My, I trust my government. I work for the government. Okay. Yeah. See, they wouldn't be spraying us right now with chemicals, would they? I don't see any chemicals being spread. No. You never look up in the sky? All the time. Okay. You ever see like I trails? see snow today. You ever see trails on a clear sky come out of an airplane that never dissipate and they just get wider and wider and wider? I think that could be an example of uh, what we were discussing. Could that be an example of what we were discussing? I don't know. There's no correlation between the two? I don't know. You ever investigated such an idea? No. Why would it cross your mind, right? When, exactly. you, tr when you trust your government, you would never do anything wrong with it. You take your flu shot, you have to take your flu shot when you're here? What's that? Hey, Josh. I got to pick up. I got to. Right? Yeah.